My name is Chris Thebe and I have had speech and language therapy. It was during the lockdown really, um, so I was having, I've always had a stammer um, with my speech ever since I was a child and I've gone through gone through a few rounds of speech therapy but um, I found that in lockdown work from, from home that my speech was getting really bad and I could barely hold a conversation and it caused me a lot of anxiety so um, I looked into a few different types of speech therapy and, and, I, and I went to my GP and he referred me to the speech therapy in um, well after hospital in Darlington. I, uh, arranged them um, a session. She explained the different types of therapy that were on offer. We chose to um, do acceptance therapy, which basically just accepting that stammer is how I'm going to speak for forever, because I have and I will, and basically just outlined the, like, the process that we we're going to go through. I've had lots of therapy in the past, and and but basically, what happens in therapy, it works great, and as soon as you go in the outside world, it doesn't work. So, I was cut sort of had that attitude, but I wanted to be open-minded and give it a go and see where where it was going to lead me. So, kind of like went back and stuff. It was a change in the attitude I had about how I spoke, because basically I was conscious and anxious about speaking to people in public and it was sort of to change my mindset just for me to to think that it's okay that I talk like this and and it's and it's kind of like in and, and it isn't an issue anymore whilst in the past I've had like decades of being told that I have to change to change how I speak and now I can just speak how I am and it's just acceptable. So I think I think that was a key part of the acceptance. Change me, it has changed my my how I think about how how I speak and stuff. I'm not I wouldn't say I was hundred percent happy with how I speak, but I, I don't think I'm ever gonna be, but I'm a lot more comfortable in my own skin around how I speak to people and stuff like that. It's like anything in life, you do have to put in that effort and then you get the words out of it. You can't just expect it just to change your life or change things without any hard work, really. Yeah. But, um, and it's worth going down, it really is. you just got to be open-minded about it and want to change and, and, and it'll help you.